Good evening, everyone. Thank you again for joining me in my kitchen tonight. Um, I'm going to be making a really quick supper. We're here a little bit later and my chicken didn't thaw like what I wanted it to. So I at least had a backup plan and we're going to have what we call chicken burgers. So what I do is I have a ground, uh, I'm sorry, one pound of ground chicken in here. And all I do is I just take a bunch of different spices with one egg, I mix it up and we're going to make it into burgers. So it's a really quick, really easy meal um, that you can make in a pinch. So right now I have paprika in there. I've put oregano in, a little bit of black pepper. I'm gonna put just a little bit of sea salt in there. I don't like a lot, so just a tad bit. Although it comes out fast all the time, so I just have to watch. I'm gonna put some garlic powder in here, along with some basil leaves. Except it's a new one, so I'm gonna have to open it up. There we go. We're gonna shake just a couple of it in there. Okay, while I'm doing that, I'm gonna warm up my pan. What I like to do is I just use this griddle pan here to um, brown up the chicken burgers. And all you do is you just simply, it's really this simple, it really is. All you do is you just simply mix it together. I'm gonna put my egg in here, you just crack it in there. And again, just like Isabella always tells us, once we crack our egg, we wanna make sure that we wash our hands. along with washing the countertop later on in case any of it spilled all over. And then I'm simply, I'm just going to stir it up together. Sometimes it's a little hard to find ground chicken at the grocery store, um, but I do get this from Myers. Um, it's really nice. I actually have my groceries delivered to my house, so they have ground chicken right there. Okay, so once I have this all mixed up and my pan is starting to warm up, all I simply do is I just dish them out into little patties. So you won't want to mix them with your hands at all because they are kind of slimy um, and your hands will get really, really messy. So all I simply do is I just take a little bit and just put it on my pan here. I don't spray my pan or anything because this is, um, it has enough grease on it or oil or whatever it is. Again, I don't know how to cook, so it has something on it, so I don't have to um, have anything on my pan at all. And then I just simply shape them into patties. These will take mm, like five or ten minutes to cook up. They really don't take very long at all to cook up. And then I just um, take like a half of a wheat bun and I use that for my bun. Some people use eggplant for their bun. I haven't ventured into that yet. I think I'm gonna try it though. So one day I might pop on here and make that and try that out, try something new. Some things I like that I try and some things I don't. Um, but I like to put on my chicken burgers, I like to put um, green peppers on there. I also like to use avocados um, as well as onions. So you can put anything that you like on your chicken burgers as well. All right, so I almost have those on there. So this is gonna be a really quick video tonight because this really is all there is to making it. And so now I'll just cook them up. Again, we'll post pictures. Once we have them cooked up, we won't make, the, make you wait the whole time. Um, for those of you who are on the portion control um, plans, this is a uh, protein, so you do wanna make sure that it fits into your protein cup. Um, and that really is all tonight. It was a really simple one. So definitely message me, let me know if you've been able to make the chicken burgers and show me some pictures. Have a wonderful night, bye.